All right, that should do it. <laughs> Every time there's an update to uh, my equipment, there's always hiccups. Although this time the audio didn't start playing because I forgot to charge my uh, PS4 controller. So I have it hooked in here through the computer. Picked it up as a USB device, even though it's still hooked up to the uh, to the PS4. Let's go ahead and switch back over to game view. There we go. Hello, hello. What is up, Macro Lewis? So, should got everything up and running. Can hear everything. I was feeling nostalgic. I want to play some Mega Man X. So, we're going to play some Mega Man X. And see if we can do it all in one sitting. Which, it isn't a very long game. So, it should be 100% doable in one sitting. But I picked this up earlier on sale. And, uh, was kind of feeling nostalgic for getting some Mega Man X going on. Doesn't help I've been listening to a lot of Mega Man X music, especially Mega Man Zero music, because it is really catchy. So no save data found. New save data must be created. Sure. Save data created. All right. This game has an autosave feature. Neat. Thanks for letting me know. All right, so what do we got available? We got the first four Mega Man X games. That's fine. Those are like probably my favorite of the Mega Man uh, X games. What do we have in the museum? Music player, potter gallery, trailers. They have, oh, they gave you the movie too? Well, I'll take it. Although it's not accurate to the original story, but whatever, that's still cool. Hunter medals. I was told this would be like achievements slash trophies. Oh, that one's a mystery. In Buster, we trust. Defeat any of the eight Maverick bosses in Mega Man X. Alright, that one should be pretty easy to do. Cut off Flame Mammoth Trunk. Easy. Peasy. Knock off Armored Armadillo. That sounds pretty easy too. View 20 images. Oh, is it not in order? Complete Mega Man X. Cannot be earned in Rookie Hunter. Pfft, we ain't no rookies here. Obtain all four armor upgrades. That's easy. Never hearts to be careful. Alright, so it's pretty much just play the game and you'll probably unlock uh, most of the stuff. Gimp my ride. <laughs> Gimp my ride. Oh man, can't wait. Cannot wait. Any anything else? Anything else weird? I think they was told that I would replay the first level for something. He's actually called Vava. Yeah, it's this one. Uh, complete the opening stage of any game in both the English and Japanese version. So I'll run the English version and then I'll run the Japanese version real quick. But yeah, let's uh, let's do some Mega Man X. Let's start this off. Rookie Hunter mode off, 100%. I uh, I don't need any rookie stuff. I don't need to make the game any easier. Maybe X5 and X6 to make it a little more uh, less annoying. Uh oh, I'm already seeing something I don't like, guys. I'm already seeing something I don't like. Can we uh, pull up menus? We'll do it after this. I remember being a kid and seeing this for the first time. He's like, oh man, Mega Man looks way different. He's got a white glove on and everything. <laughs> and it still has the same old slowdowns and everything through the scrolling. But it looks like it's got some Super Eagle style filter to like smooth it out and uh... You guys know me. I like my I like my pixels. I want to see pixels. X is the first of a new generation of robots which contain an innovative new feature, the ability to think, feel and make their own decisions. However, disability could be very dangerous. If X were to break the first rule of robotics, a robot must never harm a human being, the result would be disastrous and I fear that no force on earth could stop him. Approximately 30 years will be required before we can safely confirm his reliability. Unfortunately, I will not live to see that day, nor do I have anyone to carry on my work. Therefore, I've decided to seal him in this capsule, which will test his internal systems until his reliability has been confirmed. Please do not disturb this capsule until that time. X possesses great risks as well as great possibilities. I can only hope for the best. September 18th, 20XX, Thomas Light.
digging it so far. Alright, but I didn't want to check this, because uh, <laughs> I don't like these filters. No, that's not going to be it. How can we pull up... Do-do-do-do. Uh, what would be the best approach? Because, uh, would it be in the regular? I don't think they would have edited the ROM to do this, right? Oh, see, look look how terrible that looks. It's all, ugh. There's got to be a way to uh, pull this up, though. Oh. Did I accidentally change this? I did accidentally change it. Jump. Dash. Select. Select. And menu. There, put it all back to normal. Oh! Silly me. It's the touchpad. Uh, screen size? What are, our, what are screen sizes? Type 1, type 2, definitely not type 3. I, I, I can do type 1. I'm, I'm actually kind of fine with type 1. Just stretch it out vertically. That's good enough for me. Filters. Here we go. Type 1, type 2. I would love to do a scanline filter, but I know it's just not going to look good on stream. So, no filters, please. Oh, we can change some wallpapers. Let's leave a Mega Man X theme. Exit. Quit the game? No. Just go back. There we go. I like that better. Alright. Do, 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 do. Love this game. Do, 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 do. Alright, let's see if I still got it. It's sad this is going to look better than my uh, Let's Play from a couple years ago. Just because my uh, equipment <laughs> is so much better now. It wasn't that my equipment, I shouldn't say that, it wasn't that my equipment was bad. It was more so inexperience and checking video footage and seeing how everything was. Although I could probably chalk it up to some issues with the Elgato not liking or playing well with the, uh... What was I using at the time? I think I was using the Retron 5 to play the original game. Do 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 do. Am I gonna replay the first level? You know what? Let's let's play through the game a little bit, or should we do? The, I don't know. Should we do the first level all over again just to get it knocked out and get whatever that is? His his name is Vava. I remember the first time I discovered that his name was Vava was I think because of the Game Boy Color game, the uh, Mega Man Extreme, and then I got to this area, basically the uh, the highway equivalent of that game. And I ran into it, I was like, Vava, what are you doing here? And I was like, Vava? Who the hell is Vava? Do, 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 do. Always been a fan of the Mega Man X games. Not so much Mega Man Classic. Not that there's anything wrong with it, but... I don't know. Mega Man X just drew me in a lot more. Oh yeah, these guys. Uh, I I know you're on the way. Keep your distance. And that guy just rode right off the the highway. Can we still do riding on cars? We can still do riding on cars. Oh, but it, I forgot, it always slows down once it gets there. Because uh, if you jump on it too many times, it slows down. I think eventually until it comes to a stop. Oh, yeah. I... It's not an infinite scroller, but I also don't feel like running all the way across the map. You gonna drop a little buddy for me to play with? Being extra neato. Well, 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 if it isn't Vile, or Vava, if you're playing in Japanese, can I still troll him? Hold on. Do I still have what it takes to troll him for a little bit? You know what? I'll be disappointed if it isn't uh, a little trophy thing. Just kind of like troll him, just keep bouncing up and down. Just... Oh no! Oh no! Actually, there's a bigger way for me to troll him. It's for him to actually let him actually take me down. Alright, alright, but I don't want to do this forever either. 
You worthless piece of scrap metal. Did you think you could defeat me? No, Boba Fett. I didn't think I could win. Not at all. Oh, what do we have here? That was cool. He had a charge shot. I guess I'm not powerful enough to defeat him. X, you shouldn't expect to defeat him. He is a He is designed to be a war machine. Remember, you have not reached full power yet. If you use all the abilities you were designed with, you should become stronger. You may even become as powerful as I am. I'll scout ahead and collect as much information on Sigma's fortress as I can. I'll meet up with you when you get there. See you later. X, I know you can do it. Oh, we can save. I wonder how the save feature works here, though. Uh, we got our uh, eight Mavericks that we gotta take out. But let's see, uh... How do we even turn this to... Japanese? Oh, it says it right there at the bottom. Change game edition. Let's play some Rockman X instead. Apparently we just have to beat the first level. So I'll just blaze through it. And then we'll... We'll have that done. That was in English, though. Did I do it right? Oh, no, it says Rockman there. Do, 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 do. Do, 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 do. All of this is in English, though. I'm gonna pop in my, uh... Oh, oops. I'm gonna pop... I have a copy of Rockman X for uh, Super Famicom. Maybe I'll pop it in and see how much of the game is in English. I'm gonna guess just the dialogue stuff is in Japanese. Actually, I stand corrected, because all of that's written in English, too. Did they just, you know, call it Rockman X and, uh... Just change the title screen and call it a day? No, there's gotta be Japanese text. Somewhere. Can we just power through it? Yeah, we... We should be able to just power through all of this. Yeesh. Yeesh. We don't actually have to defeat these guys, so let's just, uh... Because we want to get to the meat and potatoes. We want to play the game, not replay the first level a billion times. Do, 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 do. Oh no, he's inching along ever closer. You guys know you can actually die here? <laughs> I discovered that by accident, uh, some time ago. I don't know if I did it on the on the Let's Play, though. But if you stand right next to it as it's coming down, it counts as a crush. So it's an instant kill. So either there, you have, you'd have to be, like, on the ground, obviously, and then you'd, like, squeeze underneath it. Jump in the shoe. Oh, I missed. You know, it wasn't until, like, the third or fourth playthrough that I noticed that the, uh, street lights actually light up the, uh, area. It's little, little, like, attention to detail that I love about these kind of games. Do -do -do -do. I like how the background, though. And that part I never noticed as a kid, and then eventually the foreground just covers it up, and it's just... I guess it's supposed to make it feel like you're at the outskirts. So we gotta destroy two of these carts. Oh, never mind. I, st I stand corrected. It's three. Alright, what's... What's good, Vile? I mean, just kidding, Vava. Oh, wait, that's right. I said I wasn't gonna... I was gonna delay, but it's so much fun to troll him. Like getting up right up to the corner. And it just timing those jumps properly. Anyway, I only have one health, so let me not let me not get myself killed by accident. 
All right, so is it... Oh, okay, there we go. He's actually called Vava! Well, we know what that is now. Well, I got the trophy. I don't technically have to keep watching this, right? Just in case, I'll let it, I'll let it play out, and then we'll switch back over to the uh, English version. Not like this game has a whole lot of dialogue going on uh, mid-level, with the exception of uh, of the capsules. Do 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 all right, we're not gonna save this, because we already have a save. We're gonna back out and uh, reload the English version of the game. And then hopefully, I should be able to load up the quote-unquote save file. Oh, look at me jumping the gun. I guess I have to do it through the menu. Do I have to type out the password again? I shouldn't have to, right? No. You just load it in. There we go. Alright, so... Chill Penguin is obviously going to be first. And then I'll probably take on Storm Eagle. I feel like he'll be the next easiest one. Or I could do Chill Penguin and jump straight to Spark Mandrill. Oh, we'll play it by ear. I know at some point, though... I gotta get Boomer Kawanger's weapon, because I gotta chop off his nostrils. And, uh, I'm supposed to do something else. What, was I, what else was I supposed to do? Oh! And with Spark Mandrill's power, get rid of this thing. Yeah, yeah. I still- I'm glad I still remember most of these weaknesses, because... Anywho. Let's jump right in with Chill Penguin. You always want to do Chill Penguin first. I mean, you don't have to, but it's going to make things a lot easier. I think he's, like, the most brain-dead of the uh, Mavericks to take down to. Oops. Except in Mega Man Extreme. Oh my god, on the Game Boy Color game. He is evil. He is evil. Like, I actually struggled to kill Chimp Penguin on the Game Boy uh, Color version of Mega Man X. It's supposed to be like Mega Man X two and a half, I think. Actually, I don't. I have to look up where it transitions. I know it would have to be after X two because it has Mavericks from X two in there. But Extreme two also has Mavericks from X three, so I don't know if it's like Mega Man X two, then Mega Man Extreme. And then Mega Man X3 and a Mega Man Extreme 2? Who knows? I'm chronologically confused. Oops. Well, I can't get that. Hmm. There we go. See how annoying that jump was? <laughs> There's a reason I do Chill Penguin stage first. So we're gonna get something that's gonna make all those jumps easier. Because you can't avoid it! He's right there! It's like, hey, I'm... Who are you? So you've come. X, I gave you the ability to choose your own path in life. And I hoped the world would allow you to choose a peaceful one. But now it seems that you are destined to fight. Because I thought the world might need a new champion. I have hidden capsules like this one. If you find and use them, you will be able to increase your powers. Beyond anything the world has ever known. Step into this capsule and receive an acceleration system to boost your speed. Good luck, X. And as far as I know, you cannot skip this. You cannot not receive the uh the power up and then he demonstrates it right yeah he demonstrates it if i do storm eagle 
I know I can get a guaranteed heart container. Oh! I have a feeling we're gonna be able to get the, uh, the little Gimp My Ride thing here, right? Actually, I don't know if I fight another one of these. Oh, yep, Gimp My Ride. Just got another trophy. I know there should be a heart container there, but I can't destroy that until I get, uh, Flame Mammoth's, uh, power. All right, chill penguin. It's just you and me. Oh, this is gonna take a while. Ooh, that's right. He does the dash. Oh, it's the bottom ones that are slower. That's right. I uh, I did not double. I didn't double tap to dash. Can he beat him with just two pellets of health? I don't know, probably. I was being kind of kind of silly earlier. Should be able to do it. Chill Penguin's not that hard. Alright, that takes care of Chill Penguin. In Buster we trust! We got three trophies already. We're not we're not doing too bad. Oh we gotta what do we get? What was it called again? Shotgun ice? I really love Mega Man X guys. Yeah, I definitely wanna save. Now, I could basically just rack up a bunch of stuff and make my life easier. Yeah, we'll, we'll do Storm Eagle. I don't need a, a special power-up to defeat Storm Eagle. He's pretty easy to beat, too. And we should be able to get the helmet upgrade here. Actually, we could get a couple things here. We're gonna get the helmet upgrade. We're gonna get the uh, A sub tank and a heart container. Increase my health. Do 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 do. Because Boomer Kawanger is annoying to fight. I want to be a. Uh, as decked out as I can be before I decide to do him. Which means I'll be doing some backtracking. Alright, and then the sub tank should be uh up there. I can get this uh I get this to go up. Why? Why for you no go up? You're supposed to go up. Excuse me, Mr. Blue Tank thing. Do you know why your buddy won't go up? Let's try it again. Maybe I. Maybe I broken. I really don't know what, what's. I've never had an issue with it going up. Should I, uh, just climb it, I guess? Okay, now go up! Up, up, and away! I don't know what's going on. It's not going up. Maybe I can get in through the other way? Also, that guy did not spawn in. Are they gonna make me do it the long way? Because there's another way to get up there. I can get up through here. 
But that part should work. I think I could just do this instead. It made me take the long way. If you guys aren't familiar with the way sub tanks work, basically, if I have full health, I, uh, any health that I pick up goes into a tank, and I can use that to recover. There we go. Play the next shot. We'll take care of him. Yep. Oh! I, uh... I did not do the thing I wanted to do there. Right. I forget what's in here, but I know there's something here. I think if I had the fire, it'd be a lot faster. It was just an extra life, but I will gladly take it. Oh no! Do, do, do. And then we should be coming up on the helmet upgrade. It shall be pretty easy to get just because I have the, uh, the boots. Or the leg upgrade, rather. I forgot my Dr. Light voice. This capsule contains an enhancement for your helmet, which will allow you to break some ceilings with a headbutt. It's uh, very anticlimactic there. <laughs> Use this to break stuff with your head. Become Mario. Do Oh wait, that's right, I gotta go through here. Do I want that extra life? I don't need it, but I'll take it. I think if I restart the game at any time for any reason, it's gonna probably erase it, because I think it's just, at the end of the day, I think it's just re-inputting whatever password it last saw. Do, 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 do. Up, up, and away we go. Do, 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 do. All right, Storm Eagle should be right around here. Oh yeah, that's the one annoying thing about him. You know, baby birds. Oh, he did not do what I thought he was gonna do. I keep messing that up. Ah, got your wing. There we go. See, I'm, I'm starting to get my groove back. So long, Storm Eagle. You get Storm Tornado. Do 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 do
Alright, so... We could do Spark Mandrel. I could try my luck against him, but I think his weakness is also Boomer Crowanger. But even if I fail to get beat him, I can still get his uh my chest armor upgrade there. Hmm. Do 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 do. I'm gonna try my luck with Sting Chameleon. I don't think I'm gonna win. But at least I'll get the, the chest upgrade. Which will still be useful going forward. I think his intro is the longest one and there's like nothing going on. I know I definitely can't get the heart piece here, or the heart container. Look at him chuckling away. Oh, there's no water here. Because I haven't beat... What's his face? That's interesting. Right, but this should be the chest upgrade. Oh yeah, that's right. This guy's weakness is only his head. No. From Mega Man Classic, he reminds me a lot of Otto. Man, maybe Dr. Light upgraded Otto to be a protector for this thing, and now I'm secretly murdering Otto. Mega Man X has the deepest lore. Do oh that almost got that almost got me. Do 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 do, 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 do. He's smoking more. You can see is almost done. Oh! Oh, he did the thing! I forgot he does that. Alright, we did it! Haha! -ha. And then it comes up the capsule. This capsule contains a new type of body armor. It will reduce damage to your systems by 50%. So, take half as much damage. I am the smart. Alright, with the exception of the uh, arm upgrade, got everything. Don't throw rocks at me! However, if you want to drop some health for me, I'm totally fine with that. That's see, see, that guy was nice. He gave me health. He also gave me health. How much is our... Well, that container is not anywhere near Phil. <laughs> Whoa! Ow. Well, that definitely filled me up. Well, this guy. Oof, that was close. How, much, how many lives does that make? Oh, we got five lives. I got five attempts. <laughs> To try and learn to beat Sting Chameleon without a power upgrade or a weapon upgrade. 
I, I don't think I have his weakness yet. Well, that's gonna help me fill up, because I can't actually take damage while I'm in the right armor. But I think it gets damaged if it sinks. Those are probably some of the most annoying enemies, believe it or not. Hey, that wasn't cool. Oh, I don't like you right now. Wait, I don't want to go in like this. Maybe I can get some more enemies to spawn in and get some health back. Oh my god. Probably one of the most hated enemies for me are those guys. <laughs> You'll see why. Memory serves. Can we not get the baby health? No baby health game. Give us real health. That's what I'm talking about. Oh, and six attempts to, to learn how to fight Sting Chameleon. Oh my god. Same, same, same stuff. Oh, and then this guy is here. Why are you here? That's one, one pellet. I should be fine. And an almost full... Probably should have just gone ahead and tried to fill it up, right? Doom, 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 doom. Hello, Sting Chameleon. So, here's an idea, Sting Chameleon. How about you and I don't fight? That's right, he does do this, huh? I'm remembering why he was annoying now. There's no real way to predict that attack. Of course, I got hit. What happened to my attack? Oh no! Yo, props to anyone who could beat this guy without his weakness, because he is really annoying. So it's three slashes with his tongue every single time? I'm trying to remember his uh, patterns. Got full health this time! I mean, I was only missing a pellet before. But I lose... I'm probably always going to lose one health every time he drops the little spikes from the ceiling. I might be better off just, uh... Ah, see, I got your foot. I really wish I hadn't run into him there. Really? I hate that if I get hit and I try to fire the buster shot, that that happens. All right, we we are we're breaking pretty even. <laughs> right before the shot hits. Okay, that time he only did it twice, so that's, uh... And I fired the charge shot in the wrong direction! That's, I'm gonna do that a lot, I know that much. 
Do 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 do. Do I want to? I th I oh I think I'm gonna do it, guys. I'm gonna. I think this is the this is the run. I keep hitting that instead of the the actual start button. Every time, it's like I have to be perfectly sure that the shot's gonna connect. Because if one of those things hits me, it's it's gonna auto miss. Oh no! Oh no, this is not looking good. No, this is not going according to plan. Oh no! Oh no! <laughs> oh well. Now I definitely know I can't beat him. I would have to get ultra lucky. Why? I should have waited till my last life to use the sub tank. Oh no! I mean, I knew it was gonna be a mistake taking on uh, Sting Chameleon so early on. Because he is legitimately one of the most annoying enemies. Well, at least it connected, right? Well, at least that one connected too. Oh no! Alright. He's down to half. I still have more than half. The odds are in my favor. I'm so gonna die. <laughs> I really can't afford to get hit by those those little easy attacks that I know I should be dodging. Come on, come on. Yes, I did get hit that time. Why'd you jump? How dare you? Jump and make me miss hitting you. You should you should be holding absolutely still. Oh No, oh don't do this game No, no, don't do this game. Don't do this. Don't do this. No That was messed up. Oh my gosh, that was messed up game. I'm um, we're not friends anymore, Mega Man X. I'm I'm taking you off the shelf. I'm I'm putting you up on eBay. I can't believe it. I blame Sting Chame Chameleon. I can't even talk right anymore. The, that time he only did one tongue flick, and then he did one on the ground there. Alright, so, uh, he's got the advantage right now, in terms of damage- OH PUT! Oh. That- that made me sad. That made me absolutely sad. He's gonna keep doing this. He's, he's gonna win. Guys, I want you to know, I- I tried my very best. But I just cannot beat Sting Chameleon. He is just way too fast, way too maneuverly. And he can disappear. No, 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 no! Ow! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. I can never tell what he's gonna do! Oh my god, this is, this is a lost cause. How many? I still have three, three attempts after this. The only reason I'm still continuing this is so that I can get some practice in. This is at the worst. I have the armor, so that's always good. Can't complain about that. 
do. Maybe if I hug the wall during... No, because I got hit that one time, even though I was hugging the wall. You are never where I think you're gonna be! You are a butt face! Hold still! No, no, no! And then when I'm ready to shoot... See, he's just juking me! Ah, I got the last laugh there! Ha ha, twice! Take that, Sting Chameleon! See, as a good buddy of mine says, I was just luring Sting Chameleon into a false sense of security, letting him think that he could win. Come on, Sting Chameleon. Come on. You're gonna- you're definitely gonna win, Sting Chameleon. You should totally continue to let your guard down. Every time- I thought he was gonna jump, and he didn't jump! Why didn't he jump? I felt like he was swinging around there for a lot longer than he usually does. What? It missed! I was at point blank! Shenanigans! I should not be getting hit by the tongue there. Like, I, sh I should know better. No! I was gonna go hug the wall, and then because I went to hug the wall, I got hit by one of those. Oh, I got lucky! I got lucky! I shouldn't have revealed my cards too soon. Oh, he's almost done. I missed! But I didn't miss that time! Alright, we took down Sting Chameleon. The strategy of making him lower himself into a false sense of security wins again. You get Chameleon Sting. Do 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 So I'm going all wacky and out of order. I'm wondering. Should I try to do Boomer Kawanger? And will that be a good idea since I'm just going all all out of order with everything? I think we could do it. I think I'm I'm confident. I Totally. Thanks. Thank you. Thanks, Macro Lewis. <laughs> I'm sure we could do it. What was his weakness again? Actually, is Sting Chameleon his weakness? I don't remember what his weakness is. I know it's definitely not Shotgun Ice, because that's uh, Spark Mandrel's weakness. What powers do I have? I don't think it's Storm Tornado either, because I think that's... Flame Mammoths. Oh, I left it equipped. Whoopsies. Maybe it's Shotgun Ice? I don't know. <laughs> By the way, this stage, if you've never heard the Stone McKnuckle, like, version, like, remix of this stage, oh, man. You, you need to listen to it. It slaps.
Oh yeah, this part, the elevator part. Mm -mm -mm -mm. I'm definitely gonna take damage here. What? <laughs> Every time I need health, it ends up- No! It ends up getting stuck on like the weirdest places, like on platforms. That's ha that happened on Chill Penguin stage and it happened here just now. Do 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 My favorite part of this song. I was facing the complete wrong way. I like how none of these guys have dropped any health. It's like, oh, so, so you think you're think you're odd stuff, huh? You beat Sting Chameleon without a, without a power-up? You think you're hot stuff? You know what's crazy? I can't get this until I beat Boomer Kawanger. I have to come back with Boomer Kawanger's power just to get that. That is so nutty. But we're almost at the end of the stage, though. Do, 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 do. I hate Boomer Kawanger, but I love his stage music. Question is, who am I gonna hate more? Boomer Kawanger or Sting Chameleon? The answer may shock you. Oh man, I'm an idiot. I just took all that damage for nothing. Alright. Clearly, you want to be annoying by just literally standing there. Alright, I'm uh, definitely not going to get to this boss on full health. Oh yeah, that's right. He likes to do a little, little jig there. Just climb back up as I'm about to shoot him. Alright, so this is going to be one of those learning rounds. I think the most annoying thing about Boomer Kwanger is just that he just teleports a lot. He's fast. I think as long as I don't let him grab me, I'm good. You can, you can already see what... I mistakenly thought that I could air dash because I thought I was zero in X4. <laughs> Wait, didn't I say? I keep doing that. When I have full health, I'm gonna try it. Staying chameleon. I mean, listen. If you uh, you want to keep doing that, my guy, you keep doing that. I'm I'm 100% okay. <laughs> I'm 100% okay with you doing that. Oh no, he juked me. Oh no, he juked me. Haha. 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 And then you, I knew you were gonna do that. Okay, so that wasn't anywhere near as bad as I as I thought it was gonna be. I really thought that that was gonna go a lot worse. Well, now I can go chop off his nose. You get boomerang cutter. I'm gonna go ahead and save that, yep. I'm gonna go right back to his stage, because I want that heart container. The good news is... We can just basically speed run this now. Oh no! I'm gonna regret that. I'm gonna regret it because he gets his health back if I go off screen. Or he'll just respawn basically. Do, 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 do. Yeah, I'm gonna just, uh, just gonna rush through this. Like I did the first time. Oh, I, uh, 
I mistook my uh, hitbox connection there. I thought I could get a lot closer than I initially thought. It's not like I need the full health here anyway. I just need to make it pretty much back to the end of the stage. Somebody was being cruel when they put that heart container there. Somebody in development was like, hmm. Oh, where are we going to put the heart container for this stage? Hey, how about on this section with the elevator? You know, they just got to be quick on their feet if they want to get it. No, no, no. That, see, that's tough but fair. We, we need something tedious. We don't need tough. We need tedious. And then they said, we're going to put that heart container all the way at the end of the tower. And somebody greenlit that idea. Somebody said, hey, you know what? You're right. Why should we make that any easier than it needs to be? And again, it's not like it's hard. Because look at me. I'm like blowing past this level. Like I'm doing like really reckless shortcut stuff right now. Just because I don't care about health. I just care about getting up there. I almost made a whoops. So look at this. I gotta pick boomerang cut. I don't have to do that, by the way. I could I could use like the shoulder buttons and I can just go through it, but I'm lazy. Then I go whoop. There, that's it. I needed to make it all the way here just to do that, just just to get that. Do 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 I can do Spark Mandrill now, for sure. But I also need to chop off his nose. And uh, the last... Yeah, you know what? Because I can get an armor upgrade, a heart container, and a sub tank. All in this level. So we're gonna do, uh... We're gonna do good old Flame Mammoth. I should probably get to bed. I know I didn't chat much, but it's been a fun stream. Hope you have a good one. Hey, man. Thanks for thanks for stopping by, Macro Lewis. Really appreciate it. I'm going to try to stream a little bit more, so hope to see you in future streams. Do, do, do. Do, 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 do. Well, that was weird. I wasn't able to... Oh, because I probably had, like, the height. The literal roof height. Alright, guys. This is annoying. Right here. This part right here. I'm not trying yet. But you have to clip that just right so that you start, like, wall kicking slash headbutting off of it. So that you can get up there and get the last armor piece. It is quite literally one of the most annoying things to do. So, as of that attempt, I'm actually trying right now. How many, how many attempts do you think it's going to take me to perfectly clip that? It always looks like I'm going to hit it, right? Oh, see, I, I had just narrowly grabbed it there. And believe it or not, it... <laughs> It really tires out my right thumb. I'm holding down circle and then uh, cross to try and get this. That wasn't even. I, I knew from the moment I jumped that was not gonna happen. It is so bad. I hate this part. I'm not even trying to like <laughs> be like an idiot here. I'm legitimately trying with all my might to clip that. There's no- OH NO! <laughs> I wasn't expecting to get it, and then that's when I get it. So this is what we're gonna do. We are gonna... We're gonna grab the heart container. Because there's no sense in uh, doing all of this. And then I'm going to have these guys take me out. Right after I get the next... Uh, Sub-tank. Which should be up here somewhere. Look at him. Look at him chuckling every time he hits me with that. Oh, 
Oh, hey. I'm pretty sure they put that life there because they knew. They knew. They knew people were going to have to die here a billion times. Alright, dude. Oh, no, but I have the chest upgrades. This is going to take even longer. Wait, it doesn't respawn. I don't think it respawns. Yeah, no, it doesn't. Yeah, and there is no way I'm going to be able to clip that for real. Alright, so... Excuse me, sir. I'm going to have to ask you to please put me out of my misery. Just one more hit, please. Thank you. Oh. Put me right back at the beginning of the stage? Sure, game. Why not? Love being at the beginning of the stage. Oh, that guy was bitter. You saw that? He went ahead and fired his little little shot at me. Alright. Second time's the charm, right? I knew I was not gonna make it there. <laughs> yes! Yes! Success! Hate all these little blocks. I hate you. And I hate you. Let's get our final upgrade. This capsule contains a part which will increase the capabilities of your X-Buster. You can use it to fire all types of weapons. Alright, let's go ahead and get that. First armor. Oh yeah, that's right, because we completed it. Acting right. Oh, I guess it's uh, having an issue. It's having conniptions. I saw the follow Flamester 91, but uh, apparently this is acting, deciding to act up today. Do -do 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 -do. Do -do -do. So, where is it? Well, that's not good. Is that why it's acting up? It's almost like it predicted it. Hopefully that'll maybe fix it. I don't know if that's gonna fix it or not, but hopefully it'll fix it. Let's test it. Yeah, it's working, quote unquote.
Don't know why I didn't do it, but should have done it. Well, in any case... Oh, hey! It's Thrift! How's it going, Thrift? Stream Elements was, uh, being dookie for a, a second there. We are playing some Mega Man X on the Mega Man X Legacy Collection. Volume numero uno. <laughs> Knew this follow would come in clutch. You've never played a Mega Man game. I love Mega Man X. Mega Man X is definitely for me where it's at, especially the first four games. Maybe Mega Man X 5 a little bit, but definitely the first four Mega Man X games are definitely where it's at. X7 and X8 are, are definitely hit or miss. Well, X8 kind of recovered a little bit, but uh, X7 is not, not the best game. Mega Man Classic is very... Uh, it's tough. It's Nintendo hard. Well, it was the NES era, so it's very Nintendo hard. Oh, hello there, Flame Mammoth. So, from what I saw, right, we use, uh... They want me to chop off your nose if I want that Hunter Metal, right? That's not your weakness, though. But I do need you to spit out some oil. Oh, you did not spit Oh, I did it! There we go. Nobody knows my sorrow. Alright, now I can now I can fight him for realsies. No, it's not stinking. No, actually, you know what? I made a mistake earlier. His weakness is uh the storm tornado from Storm Eagle. I chopped off his nose, so he is none too happy with me. Get out of here! Do I speedrun or just for fun? Definitely uh, just for fun. I could probably speedrun this game if I really wanted to. But I'm just kind of just kind of goofing right now. I was feeling nostalgic, and I picked this up earlier during uh, a spring sale. <laughs> the man said scram. <laughs> Alright, so we got him down. So we should probably do Spark Mandrill next. And then mess up Armored Armadillo over there. And then we got... Actually... We gotta revisit Chill Penguin stage, because we just got Flame Mammoth's weapon. So you all know what that means. Time to get that heart container. That late game backtracking. No, it's run through it. I got the 50% armor decrease. Get past some of that annoyance. Oh, I, the jumps here are gonna be so much easier now that I have the uh, the leg upgrade. 
I will I will gladly come back down to get that extra life. These wheelie guys are being extra generous and letting me fill up my sub tanks. How are we looking on there? First one's almost filled up. Ugh. Getting sloppy. It's also because I'm being ultra impatient. I just want the heart container. Do -do 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 -do. need this this game also does a really good job at teaching you how to do specific things like that right armor right most people probably would have slapped this open anyway and they would have been like oh so they can be destroyed and then you're naturally gonna want to go up there eventually and you're gonna be like oh but there's one up there but I can't take the right armor up there so there's got to be a way to break that one right and then you start experimenting you start figuring out where everything is This is definitely one of those games that uh, that teaches you as you go. So you start paying attention to all the little stuff, kind of like kind of like Super Metroid did, way back when. I say way back when, when this game is like Super Metroid's contemporary. All right, Spark Mandro. Remember being a kid and seeing this, and like. And like, all these are animals. What the hell is a mandrill? Then the other day, I was like, you know what? I'm, uh... I'm gonna look up what a mandrill is, and I found out it's supposed to be a monkey. Or an ape of some sort. Closer to orangutans, I think. This stage music also slaps. Alright, we need... Oh wait, that's right. We gotta we gotta be cheesy with it. Alright, so we got Oh yeah, that's right. So if you guys didn't notice, this looks like pieces from the airship we were on. So as you beat some of the other robot masters, or rather the Mavericks, then it affects other places, so the implication here is that when I beat Storm Eagle's airship. It crashed here, and now this, like, factory that produces electricity is starting to have blackouts. And then in Sting Chameleon stage, once I beat Launch Octopus, it causes flooding. So the forest area, certain, certain areas get flooded. And then, I had already beat Chill Penguin, but on Flame Mammoth stage... There's a, it's supposed to be like a like a metalworks factory. I know you're gonna come for me here. I knew it. It's like a metalworks factory, but the lava froze over because you beat Chill Penguin. So like different things get affected. And they get they get crazier as you go on with the X games. This game did so many things right. Hello, Mr. Uh, bubbly Face. Forget what your name is supposed to be. They'll say it at the end credits. They do like a cast of characters. Oh man, that's 16-bit slowdown! They got that... <laughs> that's down all the way back from the Super Nintendo. Woo! You know, I have to wonder, will X3 be the Super Nintendo version? Or the Sega Saturn or PlayStation version? If they did the PlayStation or Saturn version, that'll be kind of cool, because then there'll be little, like, actual anime cutscenes, so I'm kind of hoping they did that. Oh, he finally got me. No! Alright, he's down. Open, open, open. There we go. Heart container should be somewhere after this section. I also think I filled up one of the sub tanks. Yeah, and we got three, so we're missing one. What was the last one? 
I think it's in launch octopus stage, if I remember correctly. Oh no! Seeing a little emulation glitch there. We don't need Boomer Kawanger for this. We could be pro gamer. Pro gamer! Didn't have to use Boomer Kawanger's power. Come on, come on. There you go. We should be getting to the next section with those little, yep, little moon buggies. Really coming for me. I think there's gonna be one more that's gonna try to get me up there. Okay. This is where boss powers come into play. Oh wait, no. We're here. Spark Mandrill. I remember your weakness. Shotgun Ice. Let's put you on ice. <laughs> Uh, I will try. I will definitely try. <laughs> oh! I almost hate using shotgun ice against him because it kind of just makes the fight a joke. If you time it right. Ha! Nope. Ha! Yeah! Nope. Yeah! Nope. It makes the fight a little too easy. I don't mind that they do extra damage, but, I mean... <laughs> you didn't see my, uh, my struggle with Sting Chameleon earlier, so... You, you would not be saying that if you saw that. That was, that was bad. That is a legitimately annoying boss. Alright. So... We got the heart container here. Got the heart container. We haven't gotten this one yet because we haven't done Launch Octopus yet. So do I want to do Launch Octopus next? We got the heart container here. Okay. We got that one. We got that one. Got Storm Eagles. If I do Launch Octopus, it'll make it easier. Yeah, you know what? I'm going to do Launch Octopus. And then I'll go back to Sting Chameleon just to get the stupid heart container. I don't know if they if this still has it, but I remember on the Super Nintendo version, you can use Boomer Krangor's weapon to chop off his limbs and then he can't shoot as many uh, missiles. Ever, this is not one of my favorite stages. They got some, uh, little bit of tricky platforms. Oh yeah, that's another thing. In Mega Man games, spikes, instant death. <laughs> and what is this level filled with? <laughs> lots and lots of spikes. And these don't look too bad right now, right? And then I'm gonna fight one of the, uh, the mini-bosses. And then... It's gonna get super wacky. They're gonna teach you how to deal with the mini-boss here first. At first you're like, oh, okay, whatever. Easy. I might kill him before he actually does it. Oh man, I killed it before he actually does it. That's a terrible example right now. But I'm gonna have to fight him again. Except, I'm not gonna be on a stable platform. Yep, because they're going to pull one of the... Oh. But I'm going to make my life a little bit easier. Storm Eagle power, let's go. 
Come on. Before he does the annoying thing. Don't push, don't pull. Hurry up. He pulled! <laughs> I knew it was gonna happen. It was too good. I was like, wow, he's just letting me letting me go go to town on him. That's great. <laughs> this time he didn't even mess around. See, but we're doing we're doing the sting chameleon strategy. See, we're luring him into a false sense of security, right? But I can't stand on you either. He got me again. <laughs> I can't use flame mammoth power because I'm literally underwater. It'll just literally fizzle out. But we are underwater, so how about? Spark Mandrel's power. Just go ahead and spam that. Okay, sure. Electricity and water don't mix. I'm so used to just like powering through that. Because I rarely ever use boss powers when it's not against an actual boss. So now we gotta do some level destruction here. Oh no! There we go. Mini boss number two, where you at? Let's stand at this vertebrae. Never mind! We're not gonna stand on that vertebrae. Gamer thumbs don't fail me now. I wait for him to come back down. It's all part of the plan, man. Exactly. You gotta, you gotta lure them. Be like, this isn't an epic gamer moment. Ooh, that was close. I gotta wait for you to completely destroy, and I should be able to get over here. And scoop up this heart container. So now we just need uh, Sting Chameleons and Armored Armadillo. We'll have all of the hearts. I'm gonna try to chop off a uh, Launch Octopus's thing. Not sure if it's gonna work on this copy, but I remember it working. Oh, you're going back underground? Sure, why not? Oh, gonna pop up here. Whee! Gonna take advantage of that Super Nintendo slowdown every time. Any power-ups? Any health? I will gladly take that, because I used a bunch. No! No! It's not lunchtime! It's not lunchtime! What was Launch Octopus? On a serious note, I forgot what Launch Octopus's uh, weakness is. If I even have it. It's not fire. I don't think it's Chameleon's thing. But I also don't think that it's supposed to be... I keep hitting the... <laughs> the stupid button. I think... Boomerang Cutter? No, Boomerang Cutter... Oops. It's supposed to be for Sting Chameleon, I think. Yeah, it is definitely not that. And I know that's uh, Armored Armadillo... Let's try Stink Chameleon, I could be wrong. Not even close. Still only doing one damage. It's definitely not- Oh, I only have one life left! Oh! Oh, oops! Should've been, uh... Should've been paying attention to that. Spark? No. Because that's supposed to be for... What's this? You know what? I'm just gonna beat him the old-fashioned way. 
Just gonna charge up the bus there. Hey, 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 I don't, I don't appreciate you shooting all that wildlife at me like your Aquaman sending fish up against me. Sending like 40,000 fish at me. Oh my god, he's like... You know what? He's like Fordos Launcher in PSO2. Just spinning around all over the place and shooting missiles at everybody. This is uh, Fordos Launcher's original day job before making it over to Sega. His weakness is the truth. Too <laughs> bad this 30 year old game is way more entertaining. Listen, Sega just needs to get their act together and give us some more content. Horming Torpedo? Did I just spot a typo? That said Horming to Torpedo. Oh my gosh. Alright, Sting Chameleon stage. There should be, because we beat Launch Octopus, there should be, like, little pools of water now. Yeah, see? I was like, hey, where's the water here? Well, now we know where the water is. And that should be the hint that the other, deeper area of the level is gonna be flooded. And since I have all the relevant upgrades... I can come down here, I can bust this open. When you're underwater, physics are a little more in your favor. You can do this. And wham, bam, thank you, ma'am. And you can just come right back and continue on with the level. But we're not gonna continue with the level because we got what we came for. So, all that's left is Armored Armadillo. Because so we got everyone else's stuff. Which means that the last sub-tank is also going to be in there. Yeah. We, we should have everything. And then we'll get the, the super secret special power-up. Because if that's not a trophy in this game, then they miss an opportunity. But I'm going to see if I, can, if I can cheese it and get it. Also, a little known fact about this stage. Let's see if I can find it. But there's actually a callback to Mega Man Classic. Implication being an enemy survived since the Classic series all the way here. And then you can just take him out. Oh, no! Do -do 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 do I'm gonna take advantage of all of that. Actually, yeah! I forget if it was back here or not, so I kinda have to backtrack a little bit. Yep, there it is, the last sub tank. Alright, now we can uh, do dash short hops. I'd be doing this if I was speedrunning a lot. It's hard to do this in, uh, in the later games, though. Eesh. Listen, Metars. You weren't the enemy I was referring to. Everyone knows you. Oh, we got an extra life back. I know it's in one of the really speedy sections, so you can miss it. Let me see. I don't see him. Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! Oh no! If I if I didn't have invincibility frames from that stupid bat, I would have I would have kicked the bucket there. I want my fire power up. Because now I'm going to 
try and ruin his life. That was easy. Because if he gets over here and I hadn't destroyed him, then I can't get this. So we have... Never hearts to be careful. Alright. He's gotta be coming up, right? I'm so busy looking for him, I'm gonna start taking damage. Unless he's not on this stage or they took him out. But it's supposed to be one of the bats. It should be one of the bats from like Mega Man 7 or 8. Alright, once we beat Armored Armadillo, we should get a little cutscene. And from that cutscene, we should get... There we go. Where's your armor now, dude? Just plain Dillo. Once his armor comes off, even when he's spinning around like an idiot, he can still take damage. He just wants to protect- Yo, his power-up is low-key one of the best power-ups in the game. Because if you fully charge it up, it just makes you invincible until your, uh, your weapon meter depletes. You get rolling shield. And you kinda need rolling shield for, uh, for a spoiler moment. Alright, let's save that, and then it's- if I really want the super secret special power up. Finally, we found Sigma's fortress. Let's go in and put an end to his war against the humans. <laughs> Such a little whatever cutscene. Alright, so we have four sub tanks, eight heart containers, all four pieces of the X armor. So there is something. Oh, wait! Ugh. I knew I wasn't crazy. There he is. He, he looks way different than the other ones. So it's a callback to, I think... I'm gonna butcher his name. Probably gonna get it wrong. Vampire Man? From Mega Man Classic? It's gonna bother me. Shade Man? I remember he was, like, Dracula-themed. That's all I remember about him right now. I can't remember every Robot Master, guys. I'm sorry. It's too many. I remember some of, some of the staples, like the ones that showed up in the uh, cartoon series in the 90s. Like Cutman, because he's so incompetent. Literal pair of scissors on his head. <laughs> I wish I could travel back in time and sit in like the room with developers as they're coming up with stuff. Alright, so we need to make six bosses, right? Six bosses to deal with the player. What are we gonna do? Uh, how about a really strong guy? We're gonna call him Guts Man. Alright, alright, that's pretty good. Uh, what else? Uh, how about a guy that uses electricity? We'll call him, uh, we'll call him Elec Man. Okay, okay, we're doing pretty good. How about a guy with scissors on his head? What? Yeah, you work in a scissor factory? Oh. Whoops, I landed on spikes. <laughs> All the other guys, like, they make sense. They're, like, either elements that you would expect to see. Like, if you're talking about elements. Like, there was Elect Man, there was Fire Man, there was Ice Man. And that was just Cut Man. Even Bomb Man made sense, because, you know, he was supposed to be, like, a demolition robot to help, like, with, like, Breaking down buildings or whatever. What the hell was Cutman supposed to do? It's kind of like... What was that old show? There was a show on Nickelodeon called Kablam. And one of the little skits that they had was with a bunch of toys called... Action League Now. Alright, so believe it or not, guys. We're gonna beat the level... Five times. Hear me out! This is a really, like, long and drawn-out level, right? But 
If we beat it five times, we get a really, really cool secret power-up. And I'm gonna be really disappointed if they didn't make that a hunter medal. <laughs> right? That that show is ancient. So like it makes me think of like Meltman. And like that little intro. Meltman with the power to melt. So yeah. My thesis is Cutman is incompetent. I don't know what they were thinking. <laughs> When they made Cutman, I don't know what his purpose is. His whole level is like, I guess a scissor factor. I really don't know what he was supposed to be. Maybe, maybe if I get bored during uh, one of my breaks, I'm gonna just look up Cutman. Hey man, what are you doing? Oh, you know, just uh, looking up Cutman. What the hell is a Cutman? Oh yeah, he's just a weird boss from Mega Man games. I'm trying to think of what other robot masters I can think of from the other games. Like Bubble Man? But I remember Bubble Man because that stage music slaps. Do 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 do. I'm definitely gonna try to beat this game in one go. We're almost there anyway. I think I could technically die and not have to do this whole level all over again. I just have to do one of the triggers, which is collecting the, the health capsule all the way at the end. But I don't have a whole lot in the way of lives right now. Oh no! We are not doing this again! We are not doing epic parkour, hardcore parkour. Cut him out of the game, man. <laughs> even, even when they made the, like the '90s cartoon for Mega Man, they gave him like the goofiest voice. Like even by '90s standards, he had. He's like, oh yeah. He's like, he sounded like Igor. He's like, yes, Cutman will come and save the day, and then he will like do something completely counterintuitive to helping them defeat Mega Man, like. Like, he'll spill oil on everyone, and then Fire Man will accidentally, like, light everyone on fire. Even his fate, like... <laughs> I don't know. I need to look up his actual art, but in the cartoon, they made him look like Dopey from, like, Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Like, that was his face. Just picturing it, I'm laughing, I'm like giggling like a little schoolgirl right now. E, that was an extra life. How many lives? I... Why is... Why are these buttons so tiny? All I wanted to do was bring this up. I got two lives. I don't want to chance it. I already lost count as to how many times I beat this. I think this is my third time after getting all of the power-ups. But I'm gonna get that and uh... That power-up is just gonna make everything a joke from this point on. But it's also one of like the funniest power-ups. I am not envious of the kid that was bored enough to figure this out without like a Nintendo Power magazine or something. Do 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 do. I really should have been keeping track of how many times I did this. I'm gonna know if I did it right anyway, because he's gonna show up up there. The only way he's not gonna show up is if I don't have all the stuff, which I'm pretty sure I do. I have all four pieces of X's first armor. I have all of the heart tanks. I'm pretty sure I have all the heart tanks anyway. Do 
I'm pretty sure this will probably be the fourth time. In any case, me constantly running through this is helping me fill up these sub tanks, which I'm going to need to get through Sigma's fortune. Ah, well, no, I take that back. There is one portion, the one difficulty spike in this game that to this day still haunts me. Because apparently if you were a kid in Japan, you already knew because it was like a little child, like a little children's game. So they were already used to it. It was like just like a little mini game that the kids could play. But I didn't grow up in Japan. So I don't have the necessary skills to figure out how to beat that boss. Because it's really, ultimately at the end of the day, it's not that hard. But it is. It's like Schrodinger's like cat of difficulty. It's like easy, but it's also hard. And I always end up blowing like every single heart tank. Not heart tank, every single uh, sub tank on it. Ooh. Oh, wait, no, never mind. It's our fifth time. All right, guys, you ready? You ready? You saw how Dr. Light looks throughout all these capsules, right? Tell me, tell me what's different about our boy Dr. Light right now. Does that look like he's wearing a gi? Looks like he's wearing a gi to me. He's got headband on? Hmm. I give you a special present. Now enter the capsule, please. He doesn't say anything else. He just says, hey. Dude, just, just take this power up. Trust me on this one. I was working on this one for a while. You, you heard it right, ladies and gentlemen. As long as I have full health, I can now do Hadouken. <laughs> the only requirement is you gotta have full health. Oh wait, and you gotta... <laughs> you gotta input the command, so you gotta do quarter circle forward punch. Wait, Capcom, can I negative edge this? This is like Street Fighter, can I negative edge this? Oh my god! <laughs> I can negative edge it just like in Street Fighter? I can just hold down the buster button and do it? Or was that just a lucky fluke? No, I, I can negative edge it. Oh my god, they even got the negative edge. <laughs> they, they really put in the Hadouken into this game. I love it. And that's not even the best part. I said it was going to make everything else kind of a joke. I'm not kidding when I say that. Let's go Sigma Fortress 1. Now, it is going to be a little tricky for me because I'm, <laughs> I'm used to doing Hadoukens on, on a fight stick. So whenever I have to do Hadoukens or like and literally any kind of fighting input on a controller, it gets kind of wacky for me. Alright, let's split up. I'll go in first, then you can slip in while I main the defense force away. While I keep the main defense force away. Alright. Can I input it like this? Or, right, you know what? That's gonna make it easier. So, I can one-shot any enemy that gets hit with this. By the way, that includes bosses, with the exception of the final boss, because I guess Capcom was like, alright there, Billy, slow down. Okay, can't make it too easy, but you gotta have full health, right? So, like right now that I took those little hits, I can't do it anymore. So, it's not like you could just be all cool and reckless and I'm not gonna blow an entire sub tank. Just, uh, to continue doing Hadoukens. This is getting wacky! I'm just gonna run past this. Alright, Mr. Mr. Robo Turtle. Alright, I got it back again. Alright, second hardest part of this game for me is this section. Every time. Now, last time I was doing this... Oh, oh, oh no, oh no! <laughs> see, that, that's that, that's that hardcore parkour there, see? I wanted to let you guys think that I was going to fall off the stage for, you know, dramatic appeal. Alright, I'm gonna, I'm not gonna lie to you. 
I'm glad that I'm doing this on a PlayStation controller. Because uh, if I was doing this on a uh, on an Xbox controller with that D-pad, all hope would be lost. I cannot play a 2D side-scroller on an analog stick. I say that as I know I'm going to be doing Hadoukens. Straight up doing Hadoukens on this analog stick because apparently it's a lot easier to do it. Hopefully one of these guys will drop uh, some health for me because I would really really be kind of peeved wow they really didn't give it no there's got to be an enemy up here or something right oh it's it's vile stay back x i'll take him on what the guy that uh that i couldn't beat at the beginning of the game i'm sure I'm sure i could take him now let me add him zero come on game be nice give me one crouton of health. That's it. One crouton. Just one. One little one little pellet. Just let me hit something with my little lemons. Let me have a there we go. Oh, let me not be a dodo head and uh and lose it now. I, I wanna see if I could slap this guy with a Hadouken. Cause I know the right armor that he has I can't destroy. Oh no, what's going on in the next room? I want to go, I, I want to have a go at him. Oh no, Zero, did you get captured? X, do what I told you or he's history. Don't listen to him, X. Go ahead and blast him. Dream on, Zero. X knows he can't defeat me. My armored carrier is more than a match for his ancient weapons. Listen, just because I was built a hundred years earlier. I can't <laughs> all right I can't <laughs> I can't destroy it but I was actually surprised at how much pushback it gave him all right I can't win this fight this is not a beatable fight this is a uh, one of those you have to lose the fights that doesn't mean I can't troll him for a little bit you missed you missed you missed you missed you missed you missed Come on, go ahead, drop my health down enough so that I can just get hit with your yellow little lemon pellet. Oh man, Zero, you broke out! How'd you manage to do that? You could have done that that whole time, you could have helped me? Whatever, Zero. Maybe, but I'm not through yet. Oh no, Zero, what are you gonna do? Zero, what's with all the explosions, man? Zero, why is half your torso flying away? <laughs> Great, now I gotta fight Boba Fett outside of his armor. What a worthless gesture. I can't be defeated so easily. So, X, it's just you and me now. Plot armor. What the? Where did that energy come from? It really doesn't matter how much energy you absorb, X. You are still far too weak. Prepare to be terminated. <laughs> Prepare to be terminator. Terminated. Hadouken! <laughs> you cannot tell me that Vile doesn't look like Boba Fett. He literally has the Boba Fett helmet. Okay, so Boba Fett didn't have, a, like, a, a shoulder cannon, but still. <laughs> X, I've taken too much damage. Zero, you're a robot. How are you bleeding? Auto repair systems can't handle it. My power is fading fast. Your power is greater than I thought. Maybe you can destroy Sigma. Listen, Zero, I gotta tell you, man. There's gonna be a boss coming up. I can't, I can't make any promises, dude. Oh, I love this part. Whee!
It's like they don't want me to use it. Oh wait, what am I doing? I got the perfect power up for this annoying area. Launch Octopus's weapon. Oh my god, it's because it's targeting this idiot. It's gonna keep targeting that idiot, it looks like. Joke's on you, bud. Okay, but I, I also have to stop, like, scrolling down just in... Stop it! I'm going this way. So, what's the T word of the day, guys? Tough! No! Tedious! This part <laughs> is just more tedious than it is difficult. All right, so guys. Oh wait, not yet. I take that back. This is not the hard part yet. Is Boomer Kawanger? I'm pretty sure Boomer Kawanger was uh, chameleons. Actually, you know what? I stand corrected. <laughs> the weapon that I had been using this whole time is his weakness. Boomer Kawanger. Although we could just literally blast him. When I run out of uh, the little missiles here, I'll just blast them normally. This is all he's gonna do there. Bang. One Hadouken. That's all it takes. As long as you have full health. As I said, it makes some of these fights a joke. Come on, Metar. I know you're invincible until you pop out your little head. Come on, come on. Thank you. Oof, uh. It's like the game's like, no, no, no. We're, we're gonna keep you at just enough that you can't do any more, any more Hadoukens. We, kn we know we gave it to you. We know it's a ton of fun. Oh my god! If I step off screen for even just a split second. Okay, I'm actually not sure. I think... I think I'm about to get wrecked. I think I'm about to get- Yep, I'm about to get wrecked hard. This is... The- Forget the final boss. This is the hardest boss in this game. I'm gonna see if- I, If I can take him out with a Hadouken, I'm gonna- No, it's too slow. Oh, well, see, he does that. But yeah, apparently this was like a little kid's game. In Japan, where it's like something just slides down over and over and over again. But like, you have like a split second to figure out where he's gonna go. And then he also drops these little spiders. Over and over again, and see, like... <laughs> Where's he gonna go? I don't know. No! See, it jukes you! Like, yeah, I could pause it and I could just, like, mentally trace it, but... <laughs> so I'm gonna blow, like, all of my sub-tanks here. And then you only get, like, a fraction of a second. And then, when you think you're safe, then it throws the, out the little spiders. Look at my health in comparison to his. And I think once the spider gets to 50%, it just goes even faster. Oh my god. I'm... I'm gonna blow a sub-tank soon. Yep, I'm, uh... <laughs> I'm using a sub-tank. This is the speedrun killer, absolutely. Unless you get luck, like... Well, no, because if you get the Hadouken, you're going to kill a lot of time on your speed run. So you can't even you can't even rely on that. I mean, it'll speed up this portion, but I don't think it'll speed it up beyond five uh, <laughs> five run-throughs of a level. Actually, that's not entirely true. 
because I didn't have enough lives going into it. Like, I couldn't just do the little, oh, you collected it and then you die, you just jump into the bottomless pit and just repeat it over and over again. STOP GETTING SO CLOSE TO ME! I DON'T LIKE YOU, SPIDER! <laughs> LOOK AT THAT! So at first you're like, oh, okay, I'm just gonna memorize your patterns! And then he's like... <laughs> Re really? Re really? Now, now you're just... Now you're just poking fun at me, game. Look at this! I'm gonna end up using a second sub tank! Come on, I just need to hit him two more times, minimum. Okay, I had a full charge shot. I got lucky there. Oh my god. Pretty devastating in pink. Oh, that was another one? Killing a boss with, I guess... Okay, I'll take it. I just got another trophy. We've gotten a couple trophies so far. Alright, Sigma Fortress number two. Oh boy, more platforming chaos. <laughs> yep, I, I better start filling up those sub tanks again. I think there's three Sigma Fortresses. Alright, who are we fighting here? Chill Penguin, calling it right now. I, I see his little gimmick up there. Gee, I wonder what weakness Chill Penguin has. Certainly wouldn't be the fire weapon. I need to stop being lazy. I just do this easily. Oh, what? You don't like being burnt? Fire is strong against ice? Except when you're doing your little, little dash, which I think you're gonna do every single time I burn you. Oh! Oh no! You know what? I was also a big doo-doo head. I'm still not used to using the, the Hadouken, even though it's at my disposal. So let, let's see how many bosses from this point on we can take out. If I have full health, how many bosses I can take out in one shot with the Hadouken. Excuse me, sir. I'm gonna borrow your right armor. And hopefully the enemies here will restore my health enough by the time I get to the next boss that I'll have a Hadouken. If not, oh, that's definitely gonna help. But also, also, I need to collect health for that sub tank I ended up consuming. I also need to make it through to the end of this. I don't want to mess up this right armor before I can get to the end. Whatever, we made it to the end. Left or right path. I'm gonna go... Right. Even though it looks like it is clearly the more annoying path. Do, 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 do. Actually, I take that back. Oh, oh no! That was not nice. All the way at the last second, I got hit with something. They don't want me to use the Hadouken. And it's okay if you don't want me to use it, just to say so. You don't have to be mean and just spam. I can only hit him if I get the pink one, right? Because it's a big old splash. Oh, I guess I won't be using the uh, Hadouken on the next guy. No! 
I'm just gonna keep losing health. Let's just go on. Do, do, do. Storm Eagle? How's that sub tag? I haven't folded up already. Hello, Storm Eagle. I actually don't remember what your weakness is because you're pretty easy to beat just with a regular buster. Bleh! Spin out your baby birds. Oh, you didn't repeat it a billion times like you normally do. Oh, I was not expecting you to do that. You are... you are scum. I was gonna jump over your baby birds, and then you pushed me back into them. Ha! It just made scrambled eggs out of your baby birds. Nope! You are probably the second easiest boss to beat. Alright, so far so good. So who have we beaten so far? We did Chill Penguin, we did Storm Eagle. Spider doesn't count, because that's a uh, unique to Sigma's Fortress. Not dealing with this, no siree. Get rid of you that way. You are just a little bit too annoying to deal with in this section. Oh? Oh, no more, uh, no more stage bosses. Now it's literally this room, which I can't Hadouken. Da, 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 da. What happened there? It went nowhere. I mean, as long as I don't hit those spikes, we should be good. I call shenanigans. It went right through him. Oh, blue eyeballs down. <laughs> I guess I gotta take out red eyeball, green eyeball, and whatever that's supposed to be. Do, 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 do. See if we can take out this guy first. But I feel like the eyeball will be easy to deal with once those spikes are gone. Come on. Unless you really want me to, to deal with this guy first, game. Oh no! This is uh, this is not expected. This is not what I was expecting. I thought those spikes were gonna disappear like they did there. So, moral of the story: kill the eyeballs first. And we're gonna save that as well. Da, 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 da. Where are we where are we dropping boys? Ooh, ominous music. <laughs> Hadouken! Who am I facing? Armored armadillo? Am 
Alright, so I was not able to take him out with the Hadouken. Okay, any anytime you want to stop bouncing around, though. You went a little bit bonkers there. You, you good? You good? You good? You good? You good? Stop it. Gotcha. He was doing that ball form for way longer than I thought he was. So I was like, whatever, if I get hit once or twice, it's not a big deal. And I immediately regretted that decision. I would really like to pick up that health. I would really like to pick up that health as well. Will you be generous and let me pick it up again? Oh, I got full health. I don't need to keep doing this. Oh no, it's Sting Chameleon! Definitely not getting him with a Hadouken. If he jumps up immediately, I'm definitely not getting him. Because I'm going to get hit with one of these little spikes! I knew it! It was the last spike that fell, too. Oh, I keep doing that. So what was his weakness again? Was it... Yeah, Sting Chameleon's weakness is gonna be Sting Chameleon. Genius. It's supposed to be Boomerang Cutter. Boss's weakness is gonna be his own weapon. Come on, Lee. Oh wait, that's right, I can't jump and use it, because then it'll go down. Got him. I mean, it was awfully nice of them to let me recover. Who is this? Oh, this is gonna be Spark Mandrill. Maybe we can get lucky on Spark Mandrill. Maybe I can slap him with a Hadouken. There we go. <laughs> All right, we got one of the eight Mavericks got slapped with a Hadouken. <laughs> Sting Chameleon, nice gangster name. It's usually a uh, an element followed by an animal name. Unless you're playing Mega Man X5, that translation team was wacky. They they named all the Mavericks after uh Ma I just Hadouken the fish from inside the fish. They uh they uh, named all of the eight Maverick Hunters after members of Guns N' Roses. So it was like literally like stuff like Axel the Red and Duff McWhalen. Alright, that's two of them we got. We're... We're just gonna Hadouken everything. We're gonna... We're gonna follow in the footsteps of our boy Ryu. What's up there? That looks like it'll have something neato. I don't necessarily care for that. Alright, this is definitely one of those. Just It's too annoying to care. I'm just gonna dash right on through. Who is this? Flame Mammoth? Got rebuilt and ready to fight, huh buddy? Think your weakness was Storm Eagle? Yep, it is definitely Storm Eagle.
And eventually, uh, once the games start getting, uh, voiceovers, there'll usually be, like, an announcer that yells out their name. It's gonna be like, Sting Chameleon! Frost Walrus! Whoa! I don't remember. Oh yeah, I do remember you. You are highly annoying. It's like... Because your weakness is just the upper half of your body, and what are you doing? Why are you doing it? I, I do not approve! I did not dash, and I regretted that instantly. Yo, 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 yo! It's not that serious! Or I could get crushed and trapped. Oh, every time they bump into the walls, it knocks me off the wall kick. Why do you guys get faster? You don't have to get faster. You're already annoying enough as it... This is gonna, they're gonna stun lock me to death. Yes, yes. Keep doing that. That's perfectly fine. Keep doing the attack that is sure to miss every single time. Oh, he's, he's history now. All right, we are almost there. So I feel like the next stage is just gonna be... Unless there was four stages and I don't remember. Nope, this is it. Final level. Do we have all sub tanks filled up? Yep. I don't want to get hit by them. Although they're going to prove to be really useful should I die or fail. Alrighty, here we go. Can we beat the final boss with a Hadouken? Welcome. I see you managed to get here by yourself. Very impressive. I could destroy you, but I wouldn't I would not rob my pet of that pleasure. He knows how to deal with betrayers. How am I a betrayer? Should you live, I will be waiting for you. Don't disappoint me, X. Sorry, Sparky. You're out of commission. Alright, Sigma. Excellent job, X. I didn't expect you to just Hadouken him to death. I see why Zero counted on you. You are almost as good a hunter as I was. But the time of your destruction has arrived. You shall regret ever having defied me. Zoom. Lightsaber time. I goofed! Ooh, and he hurts. He hurts a lot. I mean, I really shouldn't be getting hit. His pattern's like ultra easy. He's just gonna keep sliding sideways up and down. You can just slap him on the way down. You just can't hit him when he's uh doing the block there. I'm hitting him with charge shots. And it's uh it's going really slow. He literally doesn't do anything else. He's just gonna keep wall kicking from one wall to the next. This is like the easiest fight. I wanna say that if I had actually fought the dog, the dog would have been a lot easier than this. Like harder, I mean. Ooh, 
Ooh, that was close. I'm definitely using a sub tank once this phase is over. As you can already see, your gamer instincts should be kicking in and you should be looking at that background like, hmm, what's going on back there? The final boss has three phases. Fight his doggo, fight him, and then what's going to be the third phase? You might ask yourself. The answer may shock you. Do, 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 do. Ha ha! Take that! Looks like you've been defeated! Why are you smiling? Why do you have a happy face? You shouldn't be happy, you just lost. This is the... One of the most annoying things to do in this game. Fighting... He killed me! That means I gotta do it all over. I don't know if it's because those were technically spikes, or if it was because he just deals that much damage. Maybe I'll get lucky, though. Be able to get us two Hadoukens in a row and just power right through that. Can we skip... We can't skip, but we can speed through it. Oh no! I'm almost tempted to... ...have one life left. Because the fight against the dog isn't super duper difficult. Just mostly runs from one end of the stage to the other and you just gotta blast him. I hate when I throw my charge shot in the wrong direction. I'm gonna use it. It wasn't enough to fill it up! Oh no! <laughs> use the second one. Just because uh, if I could speed through this part, I would rather just speed through it. I am that lazy. Besides those worms in the, the tower portion down there will help me. What? 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 <laughs> that was a mega waste. I almost... You know what? I'm gonna just recharge and try again. This, this is gonna take way too long. <laughs> Oh my gosh. So that's two sub tanks that I used. Thankfully, this part's not too wild and wacky. I just keep doing this until I get all of it filled back up. A generous thing that they did because they probably figured most people would be losing their minds at this portion of the game if they had to basically go back out and like get a game over just to get more health. Come on. Keep dropping the health. Don't need weapon energy. Oh, you know what it is too? I think it's because... Whatever weapon energy you ended up using, you also don't get it back. Like, when you revive. So this exists so that you can, uh, recharge rolling shield that you're gonna need for that fight. Be nice, though! Because this isn't exactly super hard to do. It would be nice if you could just give me the big sub- the big sub tanks. The big, uh, health containers. Please and thank you. I wish I could use a regular, I say regular, but a d-pad that's a little bit better so that I can do that a little more consistently. But that dog juked me right at the beginning, and then Sigma juked me. They both juked me. 
Yes, yes, I know, Sigma. I know. You're so cool. You and your Mr. Clean forehead. Let's go. Alright, doggo down with a Hadouken. Now I just gotta make sure I get I snag a Sigma for Hadouken. Just so that hopefully we can just speed past that section. No! No! I goofed again! Is it worth it? Is it worth it to you, Lee? Are you gonna do it? You bet your bottom dollar I'm gonna do it. I don't want to deal with this nonsense. Oh no! He just... He didn't do it! Why? Why can't I just do the input for a Hadouken? He just ended up firing a little thingy. Instead, you shot him with a yellow pellet, Mega Man. What was that yellow pellet gonna do? It's gonna bounce off his forehead. It's too shiny. Oh my goodness. <laughs> Why? If I keep losing health, then that'll justify me using a second one. Yeah, I'm gonna just use the second one at this point. Burning through them a little too quickly, though. It's a little unnerving. There we go. Now, definitely can't do it on this part. There's just no way it's gonna happen on this part. This part, you actually have to fight on your own. Alright, and now I need... Rolling Shield. Oh, you know what? I will take that. Alright, gotta use another one. Cause this fight's a little bit too wacky. You're not gonna let me get up there, are you? Ooh, hold on. Not, not feeling it. Not feeling some of this nonsense you're doing to me right now. Come on, one more, one more, one more. Yeah! <laughs> He's down. It's over. Trophy earned. <laughs> Mr. Clean was indeed Mr. Kicking my ass. No, it's not possible. I'm a Reploid. Yeah, but I'm the original. I can't be destroyed by you. Why, X? Why have you done this to us? Without the humans, my Reploid brothers could have ushered in a new age. Yeah, but you want to kill all people, dude, and you swore not to break the first rule of robotics. Come on, Sigma. Did you not read the script at the beginning of the game? You can't break the first rule of robotics. You can't go around killing humans. I wish I could I wish I could speed up this part. The war has ended. Should I read that in, in like the Dragon Ball announcer voice? Probably should. Should I? Yeah. <clears throat> the war has ended for now and peace has been restored. But those who sacrifice themselves for victory will never return. Exhausted, X gazes at the destruction he helped cause and wonders why he chose to fight. That actually hurts my throat a lot. That guy must have, like, endless water bottles. <clears throat> Why he's doing that? Was there another way? Standing on the cliff, the answer seemed to escape him. He only knows that he'll fight Mavericks again before he finds his answer. How long will he keep on fighting? How long will his pain last? Oh my god. The super ultra dramatic cheesy line. 
Maybe only the X-Buster on his hand knows for sure. Oh my god. <clears throat> Whoever wrote that line. You could tell that they were they were an edgy kid. Do, 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 do. <clears throat> All right, I can't remember what the name of that stupid spider is, but I know it's spider something or other. I know the word spider is in his name. Gunvolt, mighty Gunvolt! Oh my God, X was beating up Gunvolt before he even had his own game. I wonder if that's coincidence or not now. <clears throat> Look at some of these names. Baton M-501. Kids aren't gonna remember that. <laughs> Ladder Yatter. Axe Max. Cragman. Boss Spider. God, couldn't stand him. GG indeed. There's Chill Penguin. The, the, the ghost of all the people I murdered. Launch Octopus. Storm Eagle. Probably one of the cooler looking Mavericks there. Armored Armadillo. With his one red nipple. Flame Mammoth. With his knee nipples. Sting Chameleon. Spark Mandrill looks like he wants to give me a thumbs up. Boomer Kuwanger. Vile. Or Boba Fett. Or Vava. Sigma. There's our boy Zero. Lost in combat. And you. As Mega Man X. Man, I remember when games used to do that. There was always like a little section I was like where it's thanking all these people and it's like and thank you for playing the game. Oh boy, the staff credits. I'm sure something's gonna happen at the end. I'm not just saying that because I beat the game a billion times before. Wondering how this holds up compared to my uh, old Let's Play from a couple years ago. It's gonna be pretty bad. The Let's Play, I mean. Because that device was just pff, causing all sorts of issues with the capture card. Goechan! Special thanks to all of the Capcom staff. I'm actually surprised that. It behaved as well as it did, because usually my PS4 does not play nice with uh, with my capture card when I'm doing 4K. And yeah, it's at 4K at the moment. And you're like, oh yeah, I beat the game, man, that's so cool. And you just gotta chill out here for a little bit. <clears throat> I'm gonna have to check my, uh, my connections, though, to the TV. Oh, what's going on? What's this? How long will he keep, I'm assuming, fighting? You have won a temporary victory, X. What you destroyed was only a temporary body. My spirit remains intact. In time, I will find other bodies strong enough to do my bidding, and I will return. I shall see you soon, X. Very soon. He doesn't. He doesn't do a laugh. So clearly, we're gonna run into Mr. Clean slash Vin Diesel slash any other famous bald guy in media. 
Especially, do we know any bald guys with, with like a giant dot on their head? Oh my god, I just realized there's a little sneer there. They probably gave it to him because of his like official artwork there on the side. The best part is you can't skip this. Like that's it. It's the end of the game. You can't you can't do anything beyond this. So you have to restart the game on the SNES or input your code again. Game completion reward. A new wallpaper has been unlocked. Set your wallpaper via the game in-game options menu. Okay, neat. Good to good to know. What about our hunter medals? We got a few, right? Oh man, that's a lot of hunter medals. Wait, what's this? Rearm to receive Zero's arm. I think it's Zero's arm piece. I'm not redoing all of that. There's got to be a better way. Use the Giga Crush. What, what was this? Oh yeah, he's actually, actually, he's called Vava in Japan. So. In the heart of... I knew it. <laughs> I knew it. In the heart of battle. Learn the Hadouken. So I guess these all count as trophies. So I guess according to this, I have 11 trophies so far. So can we knock that rearmed real quick? That should be pretty easy. I feel like. Let's see if I can find a quick level select code. So I'll have to input a code myself. Oh wait, right, they said that they gave us a super secret wallpaper. What is it? Oh, I actually like that. Da, 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 da. Password select screen. So what's our password? And then this should put me Yeah. Should put me with everything completed, everything done, minus the arm piece. If I don't have the arm piece, that's fine. And now I kind of want to, I don't want to rewatch my own Let's Plays and see how I did in comparison. <clears throat> see if I'm getting rusty. I feel like I did about the same as I would have done back then. You know what? None of this is important because I'm not gonna actually try to make my way fight to fight uh Sigma. Do 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 I hate that enemies can spawn with the screen. Do 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 Oh no! Alright, we're good. We're good. We're not good! We're not good! Mayday! Mayday! Parachute! That's what I get for being sloppy. Although, what throws me off in that area, like honestly speaking, is that everything is moving. And there's like, it, it messes with my depth perception, so I'm not sure if I'm moving too quickly or too slow towards the platform. And it just completely makes me mess up those jumps. Oh my god. I don't feel like dealing with all of these guys. These are probably the most annoying enemies here. Alright, let's try this again. You know what? 
just gonna do this to deal with you guys, because I do not want to deal with you. Why are you here? See, like there, I was, I was more mentally prepared with the fact that it was gonna be moving. So that was an easier jump to do. I think it would have been cooler if Vile was taken out closer to the end. But then I guess the, uh, the argument would have been like, oh, X only made it that way, that far into the, the fortress because of Zero clearing the path. Although I'm gonna be honest with you, Zero. Really didn't do a good job clearing stuff out of the way for me to sneak on through, quote-unquote. As you were claiming you were gonna do for me. I'm not even gonna bother fighting. Just, just end me. Put me out of my misery. Uh, I'll feign fighting you. Pew 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 pew. Oh no, you've defeated me. This time I don't have a Hadouken to take him out. This time I'm gonna have to rely solely on the, on the rolling shield, which should be this one. Yeah, his weakness is a rolling shield. Yeah, I forgot he paralyzes you. So I gotta beat him, then I make it to zero, and then zero's supposed to give it to me. That's how I did it the first time I played this game. As a kid. It's like, oh man, I got his buster? You are more powerful than you were before. But Sigma's much more than he appears to be. You're going to need an edge. Take my arm cannon and your attack power should increase. It doesn't actually do anything. It's cosmetically the same. It does the exact same thing. It's just, if you missed it at that point, you're gonna get it. So you always end up having to fight Sigma with <clears throat> at least two of the upgrades. The arm upgrade and the leg upgrade. There's no getting around it. All right, so we got 20% of the achievements for this game. We don't actually need to continue playing, though. We just wanted to get that. Any other 100 medals I can do for just the regular X game? Alright, what's this? View 20 images across all four titles, then change the wallpaper to the secret image? That seems easy. So, where would that be? In museum? That seems like something pretty easy to cheese. But I actually like looking at artwork. <laughs> what is up with Sigma's face there? The story. Oh, that's actually pretty cool that it gives you details. X is a reploid, a kind of sentient robot, and the hero of this adventure. As a member of the 17th unit of Maverick- Okay, stop! He's not a member of the 17th unit yet. No one knows who for sure created X or what- Yes, we do! It was Dr. Thomas Light! Like, right at the beginning! It tells us it's Thomas Light! Now, if they said we don't know who made Zero at that time, then yeah, that would be true. Ah, there's Boba. Good old Boba Fett. Ooh, 
Lord of the Snowy Plains, Fury Oil Tanker, Steel Armored Warrior, Prince of Disguise. Oh, oops. Sting Chameleon, Spirit Spirit Sharpshooter of the Haunted Forest, Space Time Jumper. He's also from the 17th unit, 7th unit. I might actually take the time to read this because I actually like lore stuff. Lightning King of the Bullet Fist. What an edgy guy. A lot of these people are from the 17th unit. Like, what? Wait, what? It's not the same art. Oh, it's just slightly... It's colored differently. Alright, that's like 20 images, right? Spoilers! These are the next bosses I'm going to be taking down. That's the box cover for the Japanese game. I actually like this a lot. There's Colonel, one of the coolest characters. Young officer in the Ruffler Force. Oh, I'm surprised that they put the ultimate armor in there. Wait, 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 wait. That is not the right color scheme. I need to look at him when I play X4, because that does not seem right. Oh, that's her. Actually, like this a lot. This artwork is kind of kind of cool. Oh man, I just realized all of those Mavericks in the background. This one's even nicer. And then what? Switch to the secret whatever it said. I mean, I already had it on, so does that not count? And then switch to the super secret special. Oh, reconnaissance complete. Yeah, I got it. Hey, That was pretty easy. It's starting to wind down a little bit now. Any other neato metal stuff that we can get? Half the saga. We definitely haven't done that yet. Friendly neighborhood Mega Man. Use Silk Shot to grab an item in Mega Man X2. Oh, it's a Spider Man reference. I get it. Complete all. Oh, that's right. This game comes with an extra thing. So all of Zero's special saber techniques in a single playthrough. It ain't over till it's Nova. Use Nova Strike to score the final hit in a boss in Mega Man X4. All units stand by, so this is all the X3 stuff. Check your own ranking in X Challenge. Identity erase. Blast through the mystery of the staff credits and return to the future. Oh, I gotta blast through the staff credits? What's that? Here? Gameplay recording pause because you entered a block scene. Oh, uh... Okay. I don't, I don't think that's how it works, but I, I guess I just gotta blast through all of this. Can 
Knight. Oh, I can duck. Oh wait, so this is X5 Mega Man, then, technically. But X5 isn't on this collection. So, do I just blast through all of this? Why would this be blocked? It's just a credit roll. Cats. How long are the credits? I didn't think this through. Spanish editors? Oh boy, if it's gonna do like localization stuff, that's gonna be a while. Ah, I see a message! But I don't know if I can not. Can I pause this? I cannot pause this. I see a message! Ah! <laughs> Oh man, that's great to that's great to read, Thrift. Glad you were able to get a bunch of stuff done just uh having me as background noise. Always nice. Thanks, man. I really appreciate that. I'm glad you found it entertaining. Need to uh, work on my streaming schedule, although uh, NGS takes up a little bit of that time. But also, just in general, want to uh, hone the craft and start messing around with uh, DaVinci Resolve. Well, we were talking about it a couple weeks ago. See if I can get my uh, tushy off of shotcut and start using the big boy programs. I like to return back to doing let's plays, just having fun, burning through games. Definitely helps me burn through uh, this intense, crazy backlog that I have. So, am I supposed to, like, destroy all of the like, little enemy symbols, or just destroy stuff in general? Like, I don't know how this works. This is, a. Uh, it's been going on for a bit. And I know some of the enemies are repeating. But some of these enemies aren't even from X1 through 4. Some of these guys are from 5, 6, 7, and 8. Bao Lei. Oh, we're only just getting to Europe? Darn you, Stuart Tur, because I destroyed part of your name. Capcom enter. Wait, what? We were already in Europe. <laughs> Why are we doing France? France is in Europe. Why? Oh, well, that was short. <laughs> now we're in Germany. Now we're in Asia. Mars attacks? Dai Tominaga, Bandai. Oh, Bandai, because they make the the figures. 
You take it easy, Thrift. You have a good night. Oh, what's this? Refuture. Did I do it correctly? Or do I get like a little... No, I don't get anything. I get... I get more stuff. I just can't shoot stuff anymore. Good smile, company. This is like a track that they made specifically for this collection. I'm digging it. Sigma's head. <laughs> I'm playing this with like some Sony headphones on and uh, I'm digging this bass. And me! Thanks, Capcom! Thank you for playing. Aw, it's like I was playing with a bunch of little toys. Identity erased. Well, we got that one done. Oh, man. I just realized that's supposed to be like Sigma's dog, I think, over there. But playing with, like, the boss from X1. Actually, all of those enemies are from X1, I just realized. Well, that was neat. That's another Hunter Medal, right? Identity Erased. I guess we'll do Mega Man X2 some other night. It is getting pretty late. So, I'm gonna be following Thrift's lead in a second. Taking my, uh, my behind to bed. So... I forgot how to... Here we go. Should be one of the top ones. Alright, so 22. 22% of all of the trophies for this game. Not bad. I could probably plat... Does this game have a platinum? I'm assuming that this is a plat... Yeah, it has a platinum trophy. You already know. I'm going to try to get this platinum. It's what I do. If you're wondering about this, by the way, guys... Like, all of these games just added here out of nowhere since the last time I played. I haven't actually been playing them, as you can see. They're all at 0%. This is me freaking out when Sony was like, Oh, we're going to close down the PlayStation Network and shops and all this, this, and that. And I was like, Oh, let me go ahead and install everything while I can, just in case. I didn't buy these, by the way. I've had them. They were just on the shelf, and I figured I'll just pop them in when I'm ready to play them. Man, oh, man. You can see there I was trying to see if I wanted to do Assassin's Creed 2. Which, that's another game I need to return to. Continue the Assassin's Creed stuff. Just need to figure out if I want to do it through the Vita. Or, uh... Or what. But there is a way for me to stream it. Off the... Off stuff that I have, so... If not through original hardware, then kind of original hardware. We'll see, guys. We'll see. Alright, so... That was, that was fun. That was good. I want to thank you guys so much for those of you popping in and watching, whether you are an active speaker or whether you're just chilling in the background, because I know there's a couple of you that are just chilling in the background. It's all good. I really do appreciate you guys watching. Feel free to give me a follow, and of course, if you've been enjoying all of this, feel free to follow me on my socials. Let's see if this thing works. I actually don't know if this is going to work. Hey, it kind of works, right? I just posted my socials in chat, but you can watch a lot of my other video content over at youtube.com slash Mustang. You want to know when I'm going to stream? 
Uh, if you're not just following me here, you can follow me on Twitter at twitter.com slash the Mustang. Also got an Instagram where I post stuff like newest uh, additions to my game collection. I got to actually take a couple of pictures of some of the newer stuff that got recently added. Uh, Cause some stuff still, I'm still waiting for some other stuff to come in and then I'll do like a, a big bulk picture like I normally do. And you can guys can uh, go check it out there. And of course, if you happen to be watching this over as a stream archive and you made it this far on YouTube, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below. Subscribe to the channel to help it grow. Click the little bell icon to be in the know. And of course, guys, I will catch you in the next part. Until then, guys, I hope you have a great night and take care.